Hey, what is up guys? Corey here and today we are looking at a Best Tech Bags Budget Edition. Now all three of these bags will come in at under 50 bucks and let's check them out right after this. Alrighty guys, so before I jump into this, I am trying to conserve your time as most as possible. So, uh, all of these bags do have some common features, uh, including they do fit up to a 15.6 inch laptop. Um, these would be great everyday carry bags, they'd be great school bags, uh, even a travel bag if that's what you're looking for. So the three bags on the table today, one is going to be from a company called Kaka. I know, it's a pretty shitty name. Uh, another bag from a company called LifeWit. Uh, and the last but not least is from a company called La Packer. So the first backpack we're bringing to the tables from a company called La Packer. Um, now this is a good name of the game. I've heard of their brand name for a while. I've had this backpack for a while. Uh, and I know they have all sorts of other designs, colors, things of that nature. So out of the three backpacks you're seeing today, this one will have the most pockets as well as you can store the most amount of stuff inside. So the front pocket is not all that special. It does have a nice little orange trim to it which is cool. Um, the middle pocket, about the same. About the same you're gonna get with any other backpack. Uh, you get a mesh pocket, you get maybe some uh, hard drive pockets, and then some pen and pencil slots. Now up top we are getting a quick access pocket, which is awesome for those items like your phone, wallet, keys, um, things you really don't wanna have to rummage in there to find. So jumping into the main guns of this backpack, we are getting a laptop slot as well as a tablet slot. And then we get a little strap here, which keeps those devices from moving. Now a notable feature here with this laptop slot is we're actually getting a ton of padding. Um, now some of you might not even carry a laptop in here, but for those of you that do, know that your device is just a little bit more protected. So on the back side of the little packer, we're getting a ton of padding. Um, we're also getting a hidden pocket down here that will span the length of the backpack. And last but not least, we are getting a luggage strap. So if you are a frequent traveler, uh, just throw this kind of on those rails of your luggage. And there you go. You don't have to carry this while you're in the airport. Now, one of the last things I wanted to touch on was the side pockets. Um, we're actually not getting drink compartments with this backpack. So that's the only negative or the flaw that I see. So the next bag that we have on the table today is from a company called Kaka. Now this bag does have a pretty unique design in itself. Um, you know it's kind of got its two-toned look and it's kind of a cross between a traditional backpack and then a duffel style backpack. Now taking a quick peek at the bag we do get a little quick access front pocket. Um, we get our little side pockets that could be doubled as some water bottle compartments. Now taking a look at the interior of this backpack let's go ahead and take off this lid. Uh, we'll undo the zipper here the traditional style zip. Boom, boom, boom. We got some sweet teal interior. Might be a aqua kind of color, something like teal. Um, and that stretches the whole freaking backpack. In this, just like the last backpack, we're getting a laptop slot and a tablet slot with the strap. Um, so it keeps our devices protected. Now talking comfortability for just a second, you know, it's definitely not the most comfortable by any means, um, but it's not uncomfortable, you know what I mean? So it's kind of in that happy medium. So if you're carrying a shit ton of weight, this probably isn't your best option. But if you're just carrying a light backpack like most people, then you should be good to go. Now they do offer a one year warranty with this bag. It just lets you know that the manufacturer is confident in their product. So two thumbs up with that. Hey, I wanted to add this cheeky little shit they put in there. Hey, don't stare at my bag. Now the last bag we're featuring today is actually the messenger style backpack that I was talking about from a company called LifeWit um, and it does come in at under 50 bucks. Now we are giving up a little bit of space when we're getting a messenger bag instead of a traditional backpack uh, but with that said you could still fit a 15 inch laptop in this mother Now one thing I liked about this messenger bag in particular um, is it has this little quick access uh, buckle design if you will. So just taking a look at it real quick it's kind of hidden already with that little strap. You just push on the top and then boom there you go. Let's do the same over here boom there you go. And then we get to see our traditional zipper design. Now we get two little pockets here in the front which would be great for maybe a smaller notebook um, even something about the size of a tablet. Now going ahead and undoing the zipper here excuse me while I pull out a bunch of random there is the slot for the laptop if you guys can see it uh, and it does have that strap and the interior of this backpack just has that quality feel just like the outside does. Now on that Amazon listing there is a 
ton of positive reviews. I mean, they're just preaching about how good this backpack is. Um, so that says something in itself. So all in all, I was able to show you some really, really well-priced backpacks that all seem to have great reviews on Amazon. They all have their own unique features. Um, and if that didn't really sell you, none of those bags really sold you, just know that I have a sh ton of videos on my YouTube channel of all sorts of bags, budget-friendly, expensive, doesn't matter really what you're looking for. So go check those out. But anyways, guys, I appreciate you tuning in to today's video. If you have questions, please drop them right down below. I'm very adamant on answering you guys' questions and I will hopefully catch you guys in one of my next videos. Peace!